good morning. How are you doing today? Good morning. You're the shaman, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's a pretty big role. If, if he only knew how much I really have studied shamanism and gotten into Native American spirituality, I mean, that to me is the walk and the way to be one with nature. I understand that. I really do. No, people don't get it. Yeah. My first, oh, I don't even want to say it. One, one of my husbands, you know, was into Buddhism. No, I, I get it. <laughs> you were born I, in Winston-Salem. I'm here in Charlotte. We, we've got some Southern roots going on here. I love Charlotte. I love the whole triangle, Raleigh. And you know, that's where everybody's yeah. moving to. I said, don't let them, don't let them take everything. Stay the same. <laughs> I love Raleigh. Yeah, but it's big on technology, right? So yes, it and is. Charlotte was the first. Yep. Charlotte was the first little triangle to make it hit it big. Wow. And I know a lot of people there. I have a lot of fun when I come there. I've done the walk of shame in Charlotte. Wow. Really? What <laughs> What did you do? <laughs> you know, that, that radio, that thing y'all used to have, I forgot what it's called, CIAA. Does yeah, that make yeah. sense? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yep. Big yeah. fun. Big fun. For you to do this today, this is such a blessing. And the reason why I say that is because when we get to really kind of find out more about you and your story, sure, we can go to Google or we can have Soap Opera Digest, but you physically sharing conversations today is such a blessing to those of us who've always been there for days of our lives. Oh, thank you. Yes. But uh, the twins, he and Tamara from Sister Sister, they, so, they told me to get on social media. I fought it. 1993. I said, why? She said, it keeps you current and relevant. I get it now, <laughs> you know, but it took a while. And after that, you, uh, there's no looking back, you right. know, but it keeps you um, information, you know, and it keeps you up to date on what people are talking about. So you're not confused. And a lot of my friends, they don't want to do it. They don't want to, they don't want to get on the internet, but I told them you're really missing out because it is the future, whether you kicking and screaming that and AI, but we just got to control it as yep. best we can. You know, keep it in our, you know, our sights. Don't let it get away. Look at what Peacock is doing with technology. I mean, to, to put days of our lives on there. Before we had to wait day by day by day to get our stories. Now, God, we got Peacock. Any time. <laughs> yes, I know. We had to. Yeah, when they first said, it, I went, huh? You know. But I, you know, I'm into Netflix and Amazon, and did, I got as many as I want to watch. But it's. The time of day and when you, the, t the pandemic really got me into the internet. I learned a lot. Yeah. I just hunkered down and I had a young man teach me everything. You know, little did I know I wanted to. So when we came out of it, and we're still not out of it, by the way, <laughs> you know. So true. But it, it, it teaches you to get along with people. And that's, you know, and you learn, you know, what they're feeling, what they're thinking. And they want to be heard. They've got to be heard. And it, you know when to weed out the, the stuff that don't matter, you know. Exactly. But the stuff that matters to people, like you know, homelessness and, you know, people just trying to uh, make it, you know, not just money, but in their brain, mental health, all of that. Yeah. So it's not a stigma. Yeah. But but see, that's that's the way Days of Our Lives it has has always been. It's been about what's really going on in the world. And, and the writers and the actors and the directors, everybody who brings this show together has always been in touch with the real world. Mm hmm. Well, you know, they they scandalous. They do murder and mayhem, which I love. <laughs> they, won't let me, they won't let me kill nobody yet, you know, but. <laughs> I'm looking to have a little scandal, you know, for two days. <laughs> but it, uh, it's a family over there, and it took some getting into. I didn't just walk in there and I was wonderful and warm and witty, you know. I uh, worked to, to be a part of it, you know, and I listen and learn, which is what I tell people to do. Watch, listen, and learn, and soak up the knowledge you can. Don't always come in like you know everything, you know, even if you're so-called tech smart, tech savvy. Wow. You know, learn, learn how to get the rhythms of people, you know, yep. still learn how to socialize. Because people have social anxieties these days. You know this? It's like a, I used to be able to talk to anybody, and the people are really have a problem with it. I was doing some research today about anxiety, and they said that spring and summer are the highest months for it. Two reasons. Number one, less less sleep. And, and number two, we spend more time remembering those that were once part of our life during the spring and summer months. So therefore, mm -hmm. the anxiety level goes up. Yes, and you can see it like you'll be having dinner or lunch with somebody, and they can't look at you and focus. They're all over the yeah. place and they can't calm down and you bring it to their attention. They go, oh, wow, I didn't even notice it. You know, They're just agitate it. And then I go, the bottom line is, are we going to jail? Are we dying? You know, <laughs> let's just, you know, the airport. Uh, but I'm finding new ways to travel. I said, like watching Taylor Swift. I'm like, I'm gonna get me a plane, you know. <laughs> Ways to calm down, because once you leave your house, it's on, like Donkey it Kong. It is, it is. You've got to come back to this show anytime in the future. The door is always going to be open. Let's let's get together for some for some fancy coffee in Winston-Salem. Uh-huh, and Charlotte. I love yep. Charlotte right. and Raleigh. Don't forget Raleigh. That's right. I, I want to 
to Raleigh, but they ran me out of Raleigh. <laughs> <laughs> well, you be brilliant today, okay? Thank you. You too. Thank you, Shaman. <laughs>